All right, so in this video, I'm going to show you number one, how to sh change the share settings of your Google slide, as well as changing the share setting of your audio recording. So if you already recorded your name, um, then, and you downloaded it to your My Drive, so that was in another video of how to do that, um, I'm going to show you how to change the settings. So if you are in your slides, then go ahead and click share. And then right here at the bottom, number one, you can copy the link. So if you need to copy the link and send it to me, um, this is what you would do. But in order to change it, we're going to change this. Now, currently it says, usually it says restricted. Only people added can open with this link. So what we're going to do is I want you to change it to my NHUSD. So anyone with that email address um, can open it. So like I can open it. So that's what our goal is. So then you can copy this link, and then that's what you'll do when you'll upload it to Canvas. Now let's do the same thing for your audio recording. Let's change the share settings so that way when I click on it, it'll automatically open for me. So notice here it says recording Mrs. Wilkie. So I changed it. It just said um, record online voice recorder before. To change the name, you go right click rename, and then I just added my name to the end. So that would be helpful if you do that with your file as well. So it, it used to say this, and then I just added my name to it. So please do that on your file and maybe that's easier for you to find because we may be doing lots of recordings, not lots, but a handful of recordings in the class. So now let's change the share settings. So if you right click on this file, click on the person with the plus, so that is share. Then you do the same thing, change link to my NHUSD and anyone in this group with this link can view it. So that way, you know, when I click on it, it'll go ahead and share. So make sure you do that on your recording and your Google slides. So notice here, um, the share settings is the same thing, anyone at NHUSD. And then also on your slide, please make sure you rename it, put your name on there. Um, and so that way I know whose it is when I start to open them all up. Now, when you submit it into Canvas, so let's go to Canvas. So once you're all done, right, let me give you one more hint before we go there. Is If you're trying to add your name, so this hopefully will work, is that if you double click on the dot and you change the letter, so let's just say J and then enter, it'll change it. And then you can go ahead and move things around. Um, the other thing is say you don't have enough letters you're like oh my gosh my name is really long i need more letters if you just like click on a dot right click sorry be able to right click copy and then paste then you'll get another dot and of course the same color will change will come up you can always change it at the top with the colors up here um, if you choose Okay, so I'll change this back because this is the template you use later. So once you're all done with this, to submit it, so you're here on Canvas, hopefully you clicked on um, oops, your dashboard and you're already in the Algebra 2 course. You're going to go to Assignments. It might be on the right. Uh, good Student, Good Teacher slide. Click on it. Then here, of course, are videos, how to make a Google slide, share and edit materials, how to record again and insert. When you submit, click Submit. Now, instead of File Upload, go to Google Drive instead. And then, so that way you're just gonna upload this file. So we're gonna try this out. So you select the file. It should be in Recent. So here it is. Add here. And then it'll come up. Another thing I want you to do is go ahead and if you can, copy and paste the link to there just in case it doesn't work. So again, you go back to here, share, copy link, go back to here and go control V and that'll paste it. Okay, just in case I can't access it, then you can click on submit assignment. Okay, so we'll try doing a Google Drive instead of, um, a PDF for this one so that way I can click on the name on your um, audio um, and the other one when it was a PDF sometimes it, it would let me click on it and sometimes not so let's try this instead I hope this helps you out